Oh, hello there. You wouldn't happen to know the locker combination to this, would you? Ma'am, I am no locksmith. Although I do know a locksmith, I could probably connect him to you, but it would probably take a couple of days, so really I'm no help here right now. Sorry. Oh, well then I'm sorry I wasted your time. Thank you very much. Now if you'll excuse me, I have some work to do. Okay, then bye. Uh, wait a minute. Ma'am, are you aware that crime is a criminal offense in this area? I have half a mind to report to you, but that would be reporting to the windmill. And I don't play that way, baby. But that would mean you are Don Quixote, enemy of windmills and misspeller of his own name. Yes, and I have come to this island to liberate it from their windmill. But first, I need to find how to defeat it, which is why I have come to you. Wait, Don Quixote. You must know that this windmill is just as much a victim as our town. For you see, many centuries ago, our windmill was a kind and noble windmill. Until... Aha! The kind windmill. Its benevolence has gone on for far too long. You there, sir. You are the owner of this windmill, correct? Now you are paralyzed in my circle of arrows. And now the windmills are mine to control. Hear me, my windmills. Gather up all the strength you can and use it to gather up a mighty storm. Hmm, I said gather up twice. I wonder if I should retake that or something. Uh, oh well, the windmill seems to be listening. I guess it's not much of a problem. And the windmills did listen, and the storm that gathered up did not thin out until the entire kingdom was flooded, save for the towns that had windmills, which were now under the evil one's control. So please, you just mustn't go and turn on the windmill so that you could get up on its blades and then shoot a fire arrow into it to destroy it. Uh, hold on a second, I just- Ah! Jeez. Ah, now how am I supposed to defeat the- Wait a minute. If I turn on the windmill like she said to, I would be able to get on those blades and destroy it. That would mean activating the dreaded windmill. I wonder if I made some terrible mistake. No, this had to be done. It's time to settle this once and for all, windmills! Dear God, when's the last time somebody cleaned these roofs? Sheesh, a rabbit could survive on here for months. Ha! Uh, there, was, there was probably an easier way to get up here, but it probably wouldn't have looked as cool. Alright. I've got to hang on. Even though my grip is completely steady, the camera is shaking out of control. And it's a long way down. I must pull myself up. Oh, I already did. Alright, this is it. I've only got one shot. Uh, oh, shoot, I missed it. Well, let's hope I have another shot. Why? Ah, uh... oh, good, I do. Score! Don Quixote 1, Windmill 0. Unless he takes me out in the explosion with him. Let's hope video editing can save me. Ah, good, it did. Don Quixote, quit mumbling to yourself like Popeye the Sailor. Never mind that. We have to get out of here immediately. The windmill's gonna blow up. Oh, all right. I've even prepared for this. I have my own theme music. Da, 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 da. Ah, who put this wall here? All right, brace yourself, noble steed. It's about to explode. Five, four, three, two, one. Sure. Well, that was. And so Don Quixote set out for a local pub where he would dine on many tequilas. For even though he is underage, and the evil one who controls the windmills is still out there, he is one step closer to saving the world. And who knows what other allies may join him in his cause.